Okay, so we're gonna do the IA injection today as well as the buckle injection. And I'm gonna show you the landmarks. The first thing is to find the coronoid notch, the deepest part. And I'm palpating that and I have found it. And then I'm going to rest my finger on the coronoid notch down onto the internal oblique. The next thing I wanna do is find the raffae. This is the pterygomandibular raffae. Now a lot of people use the coronoid notch to find their site, finding the deepest part and bisecting over to the site. At, for beginners though, I think sometimes it helps them to just look at the raffae. It goes straight up and then it curves up towards the top and the site is usually around the straight part right before it curves up towards the top. So I don't know if you can see that, but it goes straight and then now it starts to curve, go towards the top of the straight part. Another way to look at it is divide the raffae from top to bottom, and the site is usually about two thirds of the way towards the maxilla. And you wanna be right next to that raffae with your site. You also wanna bring the barrel over to the contralateral commissure, so the commissure on the other side, and then look and make sure that you're right over the premolars. And then you wanna head in parallel to the occlusal plane. Okay, so now we're gonna get going. Okay, so I'm gonna find the coronoid notch, rest my finger on it. I'm gonna bring the barrel over the commissure on the other side, and yes, that matches the premolars. I'm gonna keep parallel to the occlusal plane. I'm gonna go right next to the raffae, and then I'm gonna push a little bit and come in. At minimum, I'm gonna give aspirate and give comfort drops. Wait five seconds. And then while I'm continuing to push on the raffae, I'm going to head in about a third of the way in and stop for the lead wool. I'm going to aspirate and I'm going to give a couple drops. About a third of a stopper full at the most. Doesn't take very much. We're going to wait five seconds and then we're going to head in the rest of the way. You want to be about two-thirds to three-fourths of the way in and contact bone, gently let off the bone, aspirate, it's negative, you're going to give comfort drops, wait five seconds, and then you're going to deposit. And I'm going to stop short of the whole car cartridge so he's not too numb, but I'm going to come right directly as soon as you're done, you're going to save about a stopper full, you're going to come in, go to the buckle. Go about cusp height, straight out to the tissue, around the external oblique area. Little pinch, this one can be a little pokey. I've just covered the tissue, aspirate, it's negative. Now I can tell I'm already at sight for him. If you're not, you can give the comfort drops, wait, and then go further in. But on him, I don't need to go very deep, so I'm just gonna aspirate and deposit right there. Okay. Yeah, too bad it had to...